guys and welcome back to my channel. I debated for a long time if I was going to do this project or not because I have a lot of projects going on but then I thought most of them, all of them, ends this year and there's like four or five months left of this year so I thought why not just do it? I'm going to do the panning games by the Pantastic Ladies and this is created by one lovely lady called Amber. This is based off the Hunger Games, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> In the Hunger Games there is like these 12 districts and for every district there is like drawn two tributes to play in the Hunger Games. I have in my basket here this one filled with products 50 items and in 30 seconds I'm going to pick 24 items for the 24 tributes in the Hunger Games. In my basket I have around 25 skincare items and 25 makeup items. Some of them I have put in that are challenging, for example a highlighter, a blush, etc. They are items that I have considered panning into 2019 anyway. Currently I'm not going I'm not panning a blush or a highlighter. Unofficially I am, but I don't have any in my project. So I thought that was a good idea. The only thing I don't have in here is eyeshadow palettes because I have not decided what I want to do next year. I do have a single shadow or two. Um, a cream shadow I have, but I use those anyway. And I hope this is going to be exciting. This project started August 1st and is going to end August 1st next year as in 2019. So I think that is the monthly updates. <laughs> I have my phone here. But I will list Amber and the rest of the ladies in this project in the description box. Wow. I'm going to set my phone to 30 minute, minutes. Wow, I wish. 30 seconds. Can you see that? Yep. Let me just... Roll. And I'm not cheating because I'm going to look at you guys all the way. So, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. Yeah, <laughs> I have nine seconds left, so I guess that's good. Let me just count if I have 24. I hope so. Okay, I have 24 items, luckily. Okay, there was one item hiding and that was a highlighter, so... Let me just show you the items. I'm actually pretty excited about it. I think I can do this. I actually think because the items I drew are some of my oldest but it's also some of my favorite items. So I think we're fine. <laughs> so let me start off with the foil samples because I actually got some and I'm really excited about it. So the first one is a hair mask that I got in Japan from a hotel. And then I got the sample of the, the Body Shop Oils of Life Intensely Red revitalizing cream this one right here and then I got a facial cleanser right here also one from Japan and a cleansing oil also from Japan a hotel we say that I got a Matches Nature uh, day cream SPF 15 which is my day cream that I use now so that's really nice and I got my Melissa exfoliator that I also use at the moment, so win-win. <laughs> I got a, a serum as well. This is the W7 Glow It All Multi Glow Serum. I'm really excited to see if this actually broke me out because I had a lot of breakouts when um, I first tried it out, but I don't think it was this one, so. And it's so beautiful. Can you see that glow in the bottle? Then I got this Yves Rosier Exceptional Serum for my hair. I haven't used this yet, so I don't really know how this works, but I will find out. And I got a Yuledale uh, Moisturizing Wonder Lotion number no. 5 for hands, body and face. Multi-purpose item. I got my Tony and Guy Sea Salt Spray in a travel size. And let me take the lip balm I have. It is my Nuke's lip balm that I'm trying to use up at the moment. 
in my lip service project pen, so I guess that's cool. The rest of them is uh, makeup, which is the majority, of course. I drew a primer, it is the Max Factor primer. It is called Facefinity All Day Primer, and it has SPF 20. I got two foundations, <laughs> the only one I put in, but this is my third. It is the Rimmel London Match Perfection in 100 Ivory. I love this one. And then I got the W7. It's a matte made in heaven. <laughs> it's a matte made in heaven. Heavenly matte foundation. It's not my favorite, but I can make it work, so I'll be fine. And this is in the shade nothing. Matte buff. Then I got a powder. It is the W7 Set It Up Special FX Finishing Powder. This one right here, so it is a loose powder. It is pretty full up to here. So, and most of these items are uh, brand new, but in the first update, I will have them all marked so you guys can see where I was and where I am at the update. Then I have my W7 Glow Guru. So this is like an illuminator. Illuminating face cream in pink look glow. Oh, this is the pale one, so this will match me the most of the time. And then we have the highlighter. It is the W7 Strobe and Go Strobing Stick. I have it on today underneath another powder highlighter. I love it. It is so nice. So I'm so happy that I got this. So I have about this much. I got an eyeshadow. It is the L'Oreal Infallible. 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 I don't know how to pronounce that one. In this coal orange shade. It is in magnetic coal. It's so beautiful. I really, really like this. I got a brow product. It is my W7 Twist and Shape Brow Pencil in Blonde. This one. It has a spoolie. Sorry. <laughs> it has a spoolie and then the product is a twist up and that is how much I have. I will have no problem to go through this one. It is one of my favorite brow things. I have a concealer. It is from Maybelline. It is the Fit Me Concealer in 15. I drew a mascara. It is from Nils Jor, a Danish brand. It is the extension mascara. So I need to open a new mascara soon, so that is just perfect. I got an eye primer. It is the Essence Eye Love Color Intensifying Eyeshadow Base. I will start using this after my Harry Potter project pen is uh, done, because I have a primer in that project. And then I got two lip products. The first one is my eBay lip liner in number 04. This one, and it is a kind of nude color. That's perfect because I got a nude, one of my favorite shades from the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream line. It is this one right here in can. So beautiful. That is everything for my items. I'm really, really excited about my items actually, and I really think I can make very nice progress on these. I don't think this project is going to be overwhelming, maybe in the beginning because there are so many items and I am doing a lot of projects, but I really think that I can do this. I'm excited now and I'm really happy that I did this anyway because I really, really like the Hunger Games series. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please check out the other ladies down below. I have been binge watching a lot of them in the past 24 hours. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoy the other ladies videos and I hope you will stick around if you're new. So subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any videos and my update. And then I hope to see you guys next time and take care until then. Bye.